As always, you can subscribe to my videos by going onto any of my videos and clicking on the subscribe button in the upper right hand corner of your screen. Hey guys, this is RS Massacre again, and I'm just gonna show you guys how to make a YouTube background. Now I know you may have seen this before on the internet. Um, I just have the standard one, and I also made one of my own called YouTube Warp. I don't know if you guys have ever used that before, but let me show you for a second what YouTube Warp.html. Well, actually, I'll show you the YouTube one first. So we'll go desktop. Yeah, I got screen. Oh my gosh, Let me see something. Um, nope, 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 nope. Oh, browse for it. That's what you sometimes have to do. Desktop. Here it is. YouTube. Open. Select it. Say apply. And okay. This is just a small one. This will give you. This will give you the YouTube background. Now. I. You know I was. I was like uh. That's cool and all, you know, but the only thing that I have a problem with this is the only way you can watch videos on your desktop is if you click on the links that are on the home page. You can't search. If you search, it'll do this. Search it. And it opens up a new window. I don't like that. There's another one of my videos. So I'm. I mean, I'm, I'm. I hope I'm not mistaken. It should go to it if I click on it from here. Hmm. Maybe not. All I remember is that there's there was there were some things you could do on here. I know for sure that would actually like bring you. I know you can do this for sure. This will play right here. Move my files out of the way. It's lagging. Not a big deal. Anyway, so we'll change this back. Oh, and if you get stuck on this, if you ever know how to do this, I'll show you in a second. And it, it, you know, you can only do like this and stuff. Just click on the outside borders. It took me a while to figure it out. Then you can change it back to whatever you want. Just a warning to everybody: doing this will give you some lag. Trust me. I'll just pick something stupid here apply that. I don't like that. But I'll just have to deal with it for now. Okay, let's see. We could just change it back to Bliss. Teletubby Land. Everybody likes this. Our standard. Whatever. Now, this is what it looks like. It's a simple HTML document that you save to your desktop. Don't know why it's opening it in here. Cancel that. We'll open it with open with notepad. Alright, here's it. That's it. Simple HTML. You start out HTML. Body. This tells it that everything in here is what it's gonna be doing. Iframe. I can't really tell you what this does. I'm not exactly sure myself. But this sets up a frame. That's what I, that's all I know about that. Not sure about this. I think this is screen. Yeah, I don't know. No, no idea. Well, anyway, this is what this is telling it what website to go to. I know that for sure. So this equals, and then you put in quotes whatever website you want. So I just have you YouTube. This then you tell width equals 100%, height equals 100%. Then you close it. You end the iframe like that, and the body like that, like that, and you save it. When you save it, you save as whatever you want, dot HTML, save it to your desktop. So I have it there, we'll just say save, it'll tell me to save as, you know, whatever. Because I already have it there. Close that one. Now that one's cool and all, but I said I want one that I can interact with and I can actually watch videos. This helps if you're the type of person who likes to look at what other people are looking at or what uh what's the newest or the latest thing we'll do open here open apply this is YouTube warp 
I made this one by myself. I did not do this on the internet. Or I did not look this up on the internet. No idea why it's sending me to this. I don't know if it's the latest, but I'll update it soon. But you can go through, and you can scroll over them, and it, 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 go, it branches out ones that are related. That's pretty cool, I thought. But the even cooler part is, let's find something actually worth watching quick. Instead of stupid Drake and Josh, whatever. Uh, how about Trillbit Taylor? What is this? How about this? It'll actually play the video right here on your desktop. I think that's pretty cool. And yes, it does work with other videos. It's not just the one. And then I I love how it just branches off. Look at Scary Movie Five just pops out of nowhere. It's like wow. Fake. Look at this. Just shoots them out there. Bam. It's just kind of interesting. And I think it's great for people who just like. You know, looking at random videos and ones that are related. I've been looking for a way to do this for a while, and now I have it. So, you can watch videos on your desktop. And once again, this does lag your computer. I noticed a big change when logging in startup. Um, so, either disable it when you're going to log off, or you can just deal with the lag. Or if you have a fast computer, then you're fine. Mine's fast, but it still lags. Um, so if you don't want any more, just go properties, properties, slow, like I told you. Go to bliss again. So here's how you do it. Edit it. Oh crap! Gosh dang it! Keep you, you might have to tell it to open with notepad. Okay, notepad. It's the same thing. So now here's the here's the thing. Um, this is what I have it set up as. I might update this video because I'm not exactly sure. This might be actually like a certain videos. So if you just want a free warp, I'm gonna see if you can do that. So it's the same thing as the other YouTube one. HTML body. Do iframe, enter, whatever this is. I think it might be search. I don't know. Equals co um, quotation. The site or the link. You can just copy and paste. Do another quotation. You set the width as 100%, height as 100%, and then you end the iframe. End the body and the HTML. Save it as an HTML document. And you have yourself a YouTube background. For information on the video you have just seen, just go to my YouTube channel and you can click send message or add comment. And you may also add comments on my videos that is open to the public and I will get back to you as fast as possible. So until next time, this is RS Massacre signing off.